Cheeksters, hi YouTube. Hope you guys are having an amazing week. Today's video is going to be the requested beauty haul. So you guys asked for this, so that's why I'm doing this. Depending on the feedback I get from you guys and how well this video does, I may do these like from time to time, maybe like quarterly or something like that. And to be quite honest, I really don't um, change up my beauty routine a lot. Um, once I find something that works, I pretty much stick to it. However, it, last year I kind of got really into skincare, especially towards the end of the year. Uh, and so I have quite a few skincare bits in here. I also have quite a few hair care bits in here. And I think that's pretty much the gist of what's in this haul. Um, if you, this is your first time seeing my face, hi, my name is Chi Chi and this is my channel. What you can expect to find on this channel are hauls, um, lookbooks, styling um, videos, and lifestyle content like vlogs and things like Get Ready With Me. So if that's the kind of stuff that you like, then please consider subscribing down below. Okay, if you're here to see my beauty loot, then keep on watching. Yeah, I just was on this huge beauty kick last year. I bought um, quite a few beauty pieces. I re-upped on quite a few um, um, makeup pieces as well. And I did a video on my um, best of for 2018. It's a little late, I know. <laughs> but I actually shared some of my favorite um, beauty things on there, favorite makeup things on there. So some of these things are repurchased from that video. So if you haven't checked that out, I will have it linked down below or at least above my head. So let's go into the first beauty item. Okay, it is the Tula um, Illuminating Face Serum. I got to try Tula either in 2017 or early 2018. They had me pick a couple of items from their range. And the item that I liked the most was their serum. And again, this is the Illuminating Face Serum. Serum. So it says the lightweight serum expertly targets dark spots and dull skin, revealing a youthful glow and brightened complexion. Honestly, if I drank more water, I could probably achieve these things. <laughs> but it, it almost serves as a two-in-one. Now I know serums are not moisturizers, but it does have a moisturizing and calming effect on the skin. Actually made from probiotic technology um so i will put a link to this so you can read more upon it for yourself you can get it everywhere i think i think you can get tula at sephora but i think i got this from and on the scale when it comes to like you know serums and stuff i think it's at like a mid price point so if it's you know if you're looking into you know taking care of your skin a little bit more there's no better place to start than something that illuminates. Everybody wants brighter skin, especially going to the summer, okay? You want all that dull skin gone and you want to be glowing. All right, so the next item I picked up from the beauty um, department is definitely going to be the Lancome eye cream. So this is the Energie de Vie and it's the illuminating anti fatigue cooling eye gel. This item was actually sent to me then my mom decided to abscond with it and so i repurchased it again um and what i like about this one is its applicator product comes out from the center and then it has these steel balls around it that kind of help it glide on really really well okay i've used a lot of different eye creams and you know having something that's really easy and that glides on is literally a godsend and so if you would like to try it out for yourself i'll put a link down below for you but yeah if you're looking so yeah the good jeans treatment by sunday riley this was highly raved about it's an all-in-one lactic acid treatment deeply exfoliates the dull surface of the skin for clarity radiance and younger looking skin again if you don't notice a theme there's three things i need okay my pores to be shrinker my skin to be more even okay and what else do I need no wrinkles of course and exfoliation because we want to be bright okay shine bright like a diamond that's how we want to be all right um 
And honestly, I don't wear makeup about 70% of my week. So I definitely like for my skin to be, you know, radiant without any help. Um, um, <laughs> continuing on with radiance, <laughs> I picked up another Tula product and that is the Insta Bright. if you guys can see that. Um, energizing and brightening sheet masks infused with probiotics and fermented birch water. So this pack comes with four. So the birch water and the probiotics help to lock in moisture and give an even toned appearance. The hyaluronic acid and citrus extract energize, brighten, and give skin a plump appearance. Packaging, if nothing else, is very, very eye-catching. My, where did I put it? Where did I put the massager? So when, after I put on my sheet masks, I use this product, um, it's a jade roller, um, to kind of like massage the excess product into my skin. And this helps to keep like the firmness and also helps with elasticity and promoting blood circulation all over your face. It has a wider side that you can use on like bigger portions of your face. And then it has a smaller side that you can use on like the smaller regions of your face. I picked this up from Amazon and this is def this is also linked um, in my Amazon store. I just love this blush pink color. It's so cute. The next item I picked up or got sent actually is the Sasha Mattifying Primer. You guys know that I am an oily girl. I'm always always lamenting about my woes, about being having oily skin. So when I heard about this primer, I had to try it out for myself. It's a pretty affordable primer. My favorite thing about the primer is the foundation. It kind of lays for your foundation. So it like glides on really smoothly and allows your makeup to glide on really smoothly. So if you're looking for something that's a really great base for your makeup, then totally try this out. If you need like, you know, minimal oil control, definitely try this out. Um, it says it's a lightweight mattifier and face primer, absorbs excess oil, smooth skin, reduces the appearances, appearances of fine lines and pores. Um, apply all over your face, your entire face or T-zone, can be worn alone or under foundation. Definitely dries and visible. I'll give them that. All right, continuing on. Now, some of these items I have not tried yet, so I cannot review them. But if you're if you want to know my thoughts on these over the next couple of months, definitely be following me on Instagram because I'm always talking about skincare on Instagram and or my blog. Some of these I may do like individual posts on. For example, this Good Jeans All-in-One Lactic Acid Treatment I talked about already. And a lot of these items I already showed on Instagram. So if you're not following me, <laughs> why sis? <laughs> I mess with you. <laughs> so continuing on with beauty, I also picked up and I actually forgot the sister another serum and another item that I picked up with that serum that I have not started using yet is the alpha beta the extra strength daily peel it's for people who have oily skin I do imperfections and even skin tone or textures and large pores me 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 and more me I really have not cracked this open however I have been using the serum and at first I really didn't notice a difference but um I definitely had somebody comment on the fact that my skin especially the dark areas around my face you guys know I suffer from hyperpigmentation which I think I got from my mom because we have hyperpigmentation in the same areas um and and you know they commented that they could definitely see a difference and as soon as they commented on that I stopped using it every day I don't know what's wrong with me I need to get on my game oh, but I also picked up a bunch of masks from Amazon and these are the Tony Molly masks and they're like a Korean or at least Asian based beauty company 
and you know they're really known for these i tried one of their other masks i can't remember which one i tried i'll put the name for you guys and that definitely i definitely saw the difference in my skin for several days um i have two left from them one is a rice mask sheet it's supposed to help clear your skin so all their masks like say on top what they're good for so i have one for i'm definitely sure i got one for brightening or illuminating or something like that and i think that's the one i used is that the one i used nope i have not used the illuminating one and i got a couple that i will that I put in the giveaway that's going to be going to my newsletter, folks. So if you're not following my newsletter, you should, because 2019 is going to be a lit year. I'm definitely, I definitely want to interact more with you guys on an even more personal level. And so that's why I have my newsletters. My newsletter um, subscribers get, you know, get the tea first when I'm doing closet sales, if I have events coming up, you know, giveaways and whatnot, I pull them for like the kind of content they would like to see. So, you know, they really, they're part of the inner circle. So if you would like to be part of the inner circle on a chance to enter the next giveaway, then make sure you're signed up for the newsletter. There will be a link in the description bar down below. So the next item I want to share with you guys is a palette. My friends at Carity have been so, so kind. They've been sending me their new releases and their palettes. And one of their newer palettes is called the Picante palette. I know I've gotten a lot of, a couple of comments about like my eyeshadow game and how it's gotten better. And that's because I've actually been using their Rosé All Day palette, okay? And I'm really, really interested in using this palette to kind of create like a darker, like berry brown sort of like smoky eye. I've never done that and I've seen it on girls and I've absolutely loved it. So I think this is the perfect palette for that. Um, as you can see, it has all of those kind of like dark colors and then some more interesting colors with like these gold colors that kind of, they're kind of like a golden rug. They have, they have shimmer shades, which I, those are my favorite shades by them because they're so buttery on the finger. And then they also have like matte shades as well, if that's what you're into. I like two things about their palettes. One, they're really, really affordable. And you know palettes can get expensive out here. And two, they have this initiative called Palettes for Paws, where they actually donate to their local animal shelter. So I'll definitely leave a link to their website. So the next item I actually have on my eyes, I forgot to bring it with me. I thought I brought it over here, but I don't see it. It is the Stilla Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eye liner let me just say this stuff is the bomb.com okay i've used several different brands of eyeliner and this one what really separates this one um is how easy it is to use even though i've been drawing cat eyes for more years than i can i care to remember i still it's still not perfect every time is always a gamble and this really really makes it easy to put on and it also has super high reviews it's really really black um and it just it just glides on really well so i have nothing but good things to say about this i'm kind of really i'm really really happy and kind of stoked that i picked up this eyeliner from um, Stella. next couple of items i got sent by carol's daughter um i have a four-in-one combing cream here as well as their hair smoothie now i hardly ever do like any natural hair videos and honestly that is because i am such a lazy natural my hair is in productive styles 99.999 percent of my of the time i don't have time for my i hate to say it because it sounds so wrong but i really just don't have the patience i shouldn't say i don't have the time i don't have the patience for hair if you wonder why you never see it it's because of that okay but if you're following me on instagram you've seen my hair because i like instagram while i'm getting my hair done um they also included the black vanilla pure hair oil and this really if you like vanilla you will love this i almost forgot i actually picked up two wigs that i wanted to share with you guys the first wig is by body boss told you guys i would share it so i thought i'd get to that um this is the 
Kishana wig by Body Boss. It says a lace front hand crafted natural hairline wig. Ear to ear large lace. I picked up this wig in a 1B like I pick up everything else and for me how I choose what wigs to buy is like I literally go on YouTube and I search up what I'm looking for. I've been doing really short hair for a while and I kind of wanted to do longer hair so the next wig I'm going to show you is also long hair as well. In my in in a perfect world, the hair the hair length I'm looking for is more of a lob, which is what I end up doing with these long wigs anyway. I end up chopping them up to about right here, right there. That's like the perfect length for my face shape. But for now, um, I picked this up. I don't want to take this out of the packaging just yet. So you can part this in the middle to the left to the right. It's a premium synthetic wig and you guys know that I wear a lot of synthet synthetic wigs because I just want to put the hair in the trash when I'm done. I don't feel like pre-pooing, conditioning, apple cider vinegaring, using um what's that thing that they use to make the hair silky again i just don't want to do all of that so that's really why i wear synthetic wigs a lot more and these days the te the technology is getting so good that sometimes you can't even tell the difference and so that is why personally i um choose synthetic wigs also because i'm also lazy about making wigs as well the next item is going to be from Sensational and is the Empress um, Lace Parting Wig. I also picked this up in a 1B as well. It's a similar style to the other one that kind of like Farrah Fawcett, you know, um, Victoria's Secret kind of wavy, beachy curls look. That's what I was going for with both of them. Um, and this one is called Taisha. I think so it says hand tied deep lace parting wig two way parting feature I will put a link to both wigs down below if you would like to try them out for yourself Yeah, if you love hauls like this make sure to check out my fashion hauls down below I have just done recently a Target haul. I also have styling videos. I just did a sweater lookbook. Definitely check the description down below for playlists. There's tons and tons of videos, so don't go anywhere. Question of the day, where do you get most of your beauty? Drugstore, Ulta, Sephora? Let me know in the comments below. Let's continue our conversation down there. Come on down. If you like this video, share it with a friend and uh, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And until next time, stay blessed. I don't know if it's the 20s when they did the silky dresses, but it is this gorgeous, ruffled,